While many shoppers hit the malls and big box stores or even surf the web, a group of Madison hand makers presented an alternative today. The Black Friday Madison Makers Market showed that when it comes to holiday sales, these local entrepreneurs can get crafty too. Chris Lewinberg reports. And the comb helps distribute the uh, oil throughout the beard. Bespoke bushy beards might be big business this Black Friday. I always thought I'd look you know, mildly okay with one. At least that's what Alex Click hopes. Sales numbers, um, just foot traffic. This is just the second market that he has sold his home crafted beard oils at. Start with the base and work yourself out. But when it comes to holiday sales, he knows what he's up against. Um, it's a little bit intimidating, you know, you're not sure what to do but uh, feel more comfortable the second time around, and I'm sure it just gets easier from there. So does Sarah Tompto, which is why she started the Madison Maker Market last year. The community loves to support their teachers and their neighbors and the people creating these items versus going out to some big store and the money moving out of the community. Shopping the handmade keeps it in the community, and it's really great. She says that for these entrepreneurs, holiday sales can be make or break. You do feel pressure to make sure that you're getting enough sales. Uh, there's a lot of makers here who this is their full-time job, and so they're taking care of their kids during the day and making at night after their kids go to bed. But they have something no big box retailer could replicate. Makers prefer to like shop local. You're going to want to support your other makers because you know you're supporting someone that that you know versus supporting someone you don't know. And this bearded businessman couldn't agree more. I think it's still important to have that face, you know, to the brand and just that local community support. For News 3, I'm Chris Lewenberg. And this is the second year of the Madison Makers Black Friday market and attendance was up.